Developing tonight, we are hearing for the first time from the leaders of the Archdiocese of Indianapolis after months of controversy surrounding their handling of teachers in same-sex marriages. News 8's Jenny Dresler is live tonight from the Catholic Center where hundreds gathered to protest the Archdiocese decision. Jenny? Uh, yeah, Mike and Broken, this was something today that the Archbishop, he was adamant in what his own words, he's saying this is not a witch hunt. And when we sat down with him and the superintendent of Catholic schools today, they reiterated that this whole conversation today, it was about everything that's happened. It wasn't just about the fallout and the controversy surrounding Brebeuf and Cathedral, but this really goes all back to Ron Colley. as we all know, this has been a very divisive issue here in Indianapolis. In fact, these emotions so incredibly raw tonight that just moments ago, a cathedral student-led prayer circle just wrapped up here. Hundreds of people here all voicing their opinion, many of them even protesting the actions of the archdiocese. Archbishop Charles C. Thompson and the superintendent of Catholic schools, Gina Fleming, held a news conference this afternoon. Archbishop Thompson says the archdiocese does not have an issue with people who identify as gay. They say the issue is teachers violating their contracts by being in a same-sex marriage, which they say violates the teachings of the Catholic Church. And when pressed, the archbishop and superintendent admitted that if the teachers if the teachers would have removed themselves from their marriage, they likely would have kept their jobs. This is not a witch hunt. We don't go looking for, for these situations. When they're brought to attention, though, because I, as I said previously, my ability, my duty to oversee uh, the living of the faith, especially for our ministerial witnesses. Um, this isn't about looking back and trying to find things in people's past. That's not what this is about. And, and these come to us when there's, when there's, there's a public situation that's contrary to the church's teaching. That's when we address it, but we're, we're trying to address what, how to reconcile it in order to go forward. Now, when asked if the archdiocese would be looking into other situations viewed as Catholics, and the archbishop and superintendent said they had already been looking into certain situations and plan to have conversations with those people. The archbishop and superintendent said when they're made aware of these situations, they work with the teachers involved, but in the end, they only have two options go along with the teachings of the Catholic Church or they could lose their jobs. Now coming up tonight, all new tonight at 10, you'll hear from people who were at today's prayer circle and their reaction to this issue. Live in Indianapolis, Jenny Dreisler, with TV News 8.